these are the car and truck that will work with this Bose installation. Alright, a customer brought in a 2003 uh, GMC Yukon. Uh, they already cut the wire. So what we are doing right now is uh, we are installing the power. We are hooking up the yellow to the bigger orange wire right there. That's 12 volt. There's two orange. You want a thicker orange. See the orange right next to it? 12 volt. And then now he's hooking up. What color is that? Is that a black and white? Yep, that's black and white. I think your stripper is not working. No, it's right working. Anymore. You gotta turn this thing. Oh, the knob? Yeah. So that one go to the black wire of the radio. So. Next thing he's gonna do, he's gonna hook up the gray wire, which is the uh, uh, right front speaker. So he's gonna hook up the gray to the uh, uh, oh. green. Hook the gray wire. Hook up the gray wire. Is that the gray? Yep, that's the gray wire. Hook up to the uh, speaker right here. That light green right there. See light green? That light green. Yep, hooking that gray up to it. That's a positive side, uh, positive right side, right front. Ain't even lean back in it. Can't hold myself up, man. Big guy right here having a problem trying to sit in there right. Look at that, look at that muscle right there. I think that muscle make it hard that, that, for him. Uh, right here, right? Yeah, that one right there. That's a light green. To the gray. Now he's gonna have to find the uh, uh, orange. Uh, let me see, this light is killing me here too. Orange uh, black is the uh, gray black. Orange black would be right next to it usually, right here. He's gonna strip that, go ahead and strip that. Now, when the customer brought this over, there's no sound. I don't know, they cut, they start cutting a bunch of wire because I guess they, they, uh, they didn't buy the right harness for it. You know, the right harness is $139. Anywhere from $89 to $139, depend. So that's a gray and black. He's going to hook up to the uh, orange and black. Yep. Yep. No, what are you doing? I'm, I'm blind. You're right. You're on the right spot. Yeah. You're just holding that. I know, but yeah, that right thing glam would face my eye. Okay, I can't. Right there. So now that's. Hold on. Okay. Next thing he's gonna hook up, he's gonna hook up the. Uh, uh, the uh, front, which is the left front, which is the white speaker wire. It should be white and white black. So what he's gonna hook it up to? Dang, it's so short. He is going to hook it up to tan. It's gonna be tan and dark green. So I'm gonna find tan. It should be in the same bundle. White. See right here. It's tan and dark green right there. So white go to the tan, and then white black is going to the uh, positive, negative. Uh, yeah, negative. So go ahead, white go to the tan. Just follow that. White to the tan.
when you hook it up like that something like that you want to make sure there's no uh, metal sticking outside anything like that that's how you have a short so basically you have to make sure there's nothing out like this see it look it has to look good like that so the next thing he's gonna hook up is gonna be oh shoot is that hold on hold on hold on, hold on. white no that's white black that's negative yeah yeah that's that's the wrong one so white go to the tan That's white. So be careful uh, on the white and white black because they uh, look the same and unless you're really looking at it. So he's gonna have to poke up that white one to the tan. Everything's so dark, man. I don't know why. The seat is so late. Why don't you put it back up a little bit, man? Because so you can map. Yeah, there you go. Oh. Is that better, man? Can you put the seat back up? Oh, he having a problem. His stomach's too fat, that's why. No, I ate too much, man. No, he ate too much. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we'll no go to the next one. Way. Yeah, his little muscle right here in the way. <laughs> What car did? He said that uh, his muscle on the way, so he's having a in the way. In the way. Not on the way. Yeah, not on the way. <laughs> <laughs> so he's gonna hook up that white to the tan. Is that to the tan? Yep. Okay, white to the tan. Remember, the Y is a little bit short because the customer cut it. And then now he's going to have to put the white and black to the uh, Brown, or? Uh, uh, dark green. It's right next to it, right here. It's right here. That's, that's like a... Yep, to the dark green. Remember, the first thing you have to do, you want to hook up that, that yellow wire from the aftermarket radio to the... Uh, uh, orange wire. There's two orange wire. One is a thicker one. One is like a, a, a 18 gauge. Other one 16 gauge. You want to hook up to the sm uh, thicker one, which is the uh, 16 gauge. It's, it's thicker on the wire. So now the next thing he's gonna have to do, he's gonna have to look for the uh, the He's gonna have to look for brown and uh, green white. Brown would be uh, uh, left, left rear. So brown, he wanna hook up the uh, green from the factory, uh, from the aftermarket to the brown. You gotta look for the brown wire and the green wire right here. It's already made it right here like that. Basically like this. See how they had it already like this? So brown go to the green. Why is this green so short? Yeah, that green right here. That's green no. black. Yeah, that's green black. Do the yeah. So brown to the green. Uh, 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 green wire to the brown. Right there, right. And then. Green black go to the green white. Now the next stop he's gonna have to do, he's gonna have to look for the uh right rear which is purple color so he's gonna have to hook up a, a purple color a purple from the aftermarket to the blue there's blue and black wire in there right here on the bottom so purple go to the blue 
and then purple black to the black. That's purple, purple black right here. So purple go to the blue. Yep. Now the next thing that we're gonna we're gonna do is uh, we're not gonna sh we're gonna we're, we're gonna ask you to uh, subscribe and then uh, comment and then we'll tell you the, what to do next. So like and subscribe. Right now it's not it's not it's not gonna be fully done, but we'll we'll have to show you we're, we're gonna have to comment. You have to like and subscribe, and then we'll. We're gonna show you the rest, but other than that, it, it everything basically done. Now what I'm gonna do? Customer brought me this uh, dual, I guess, from AutoZone. I'm gonna hook it up. Uh, this is a 2003 uh, GMC Yukon. I'm hooking up the mounting kit. It is called 99 2003. Metra insulation kit made by uh, for General Motors. So what it is, as you can see, it's got this piece right there, bracket right here for you know a single den and a double den. But I'm, what I'm have to do, I'm gonna have to cut this piece right here like that, right there, and then you do the same one for the next one. Now you gotta take a knife and kind of trim it off and make it look pretty. gonna look pretty when it's done see like that and then same thing as here smoothing it out okay now I'm gonna take this uh, beauty ring out because they don't need that okay see now it's gonna go perfectly like that. See how it looks? But in order to do that, I gotta have this two right here. This one, you're gonna have to cut this outside piece out right here. To both sides, both of them. It's got left and right. So I'm gonna cut that out. Cut another one out. So now I got only this right there. This is for the left side and this is for the right side. Do the same thing, cut the outer right there, and then another one right there. Now, take this back out. You got to know your left and your right, so. This is the right side. You see how it's not going to fit? If I put it wrong, it's not going to go in right, so you got to flip it. That side right there should be the right one to go in. See, it's going that right in. Now I'm gonna do the left. Okay. Now you want to make sure the left is stay on the left. That's the left right there, and then the radio's gotta go up and down right here. So you put it in like that, and you. Hold it like that, but usually the factory radio if you bought it brand new You should get this screw Not that's not gonna work. You got to get a screw to tighten that thing most radios come with it But I didn't see anything so I'm gonna have to find my own screw To finish it up You want to make sure the screw is not too long You want to make sure the screw is sh like not going to go poke anything in there. So you want about less than uh, less than half of an inch. So now I'll put it like that. Okay. 
almost don't have a room for this thing. That one side, all you need is one, so I don't like it too much because see it's what we we could make it look better in a second. I'll show you. Now See, there's a hole right here. See, if you want to push it all the way like that, you got no holes, no room for that. So what you're going to have to do to make it look pretty, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take one of the... Uh, uni bits. I don't know where my other one at. I'm going to bring one of the uni bit or anything that can make holes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kind of look at the hole where the hole's at. There's one hole right here, so I'm gonna I cut a hole right here. One. Got one hole. All we need is one hole. You don't need too much. Can you put a, a filler bit back on here for me? That if you want to push, push it out. Push it all the way back so it look nice. Now you can see, you see how this thing is all the way, all the way in. This is our little bit. You can't push that. You gotta make what I just did. You gotta make that hole. See, there's no hole right here. Not all the radio needed that, but this one you, you do need it. So now you see you got a hole right now. So I'm gonna put another screw in. Oh, that's not a Phillips. I'll put it right in. Put a Phillips and screw it in. See now, voila. See, no CD, it's just a basic radio. So now we're gonna come back over here. You wanna pause and go to. Not need to use, we're just gonna tape them. I'm gonna hook antenna adapter right here. The antenna adapter is made by Metro, it's called AD GM1. AD GM1. So here I am, plugging the antenna in the radio and then plug in the power oh there's a bunch of wire that need to be taped off too cuz anything that's not used tape them that way it's not gonna shoot it out you never know. And then now I'm I'm, I'm not gonna put it on all the way. I'm just put it in like this and see what it look like. Looks good so far. So I'm gonna put, turn the key on and see if it works. It should get sound. If it don't get sound, something else is wrong. Turn on the power. Voila! That's how you do it. And... Oh, antenna is not that great, but... So this is bypassing the boat. And, yep. 
That is how you bypass the factory a uh, both system without spending $139 but this you have to subscribe and like and then I will send you the information uh, there's only two more wire that I didn't show on there but yep that's it 2003 GMC Yukon